I went to the Cordon Bleu in France and studied food and wine. I have a diploma in food and a diploma in wine and spirits, but I didn't really get into cakes until we came back from France and lived in Boston for a year and answered an ad for a bakery and the woman who owned the bakery turned out to be one of the top cake designers on the Eastern Seaboard. When a bride comes to see me, she'll, she can bring her invitations or pieces of cloth and I can match the colors exactly. I guess my specialty overall is attention to detail. It's the culinary side of me that wants to do the flavors that are different than anybody else's and better than everybody else's. You know, it's the art side of me likes to do all the decorating, but I like to do really unique stuff. The people who give me a little bit of guidance, but then they just tell me to go nuts. And they're the ones who get the best cakes because when I'm allowed to go nuts, I go nuts. And I just do tons of stuff that maybe they didn't think of or they didn't ask for or they didn't think they could afford. You know, I'll just do whatever I think it takes to make that cake really cool. I'm very picky about my food. I, I only want the best when I eat, so um, each wedding cake has got to be really, really good. It's got to be the best thing they've ever had. And then once I'm done baking and doing that end of it, I turn back into the artist and decorate it, and I basically want to... I don't want to do the same cake twice, and I can't imagine why a bride and groom would want somebody else's cake at their wedding anyway. So. Um, the big challenge is to get everybody together, hear all their ideas, and then transform it into a cake. I like to play around with more exotic flavors, like my rosemary lemon is my top seller, even though nobody's ever heard of it. And when you say rosemary lemon cake to people, they look at you funny, and eh, but when I make them try it, then they order it, because it's really good. They just haven't thought of that flavor com combination before, so I make everything from scratch. I grow the rosemary that goes into the rosemary lemon cakes and, you know, detail like that that makes, makes it taste different. I have lots of photos on the website and I have some of my background on the website. I have the prices on the website and all, all the details so that they know what I do and that I'm, you know, we're going to be a good fit. But I just want to be the best at all of it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Leslie Radica. I'm the owner of Blue Moon Cake Design in Boulder, Colorado.